In the spirit of good neighborliness, the acting Comptroller General of Customs Bashir Adewale Adeni, along with some members of his management team, strolled to the headquarters of the Federal Road Safety Corps. <laughs> At the premises of the Federal Road Safety Corps headquarters, he was received with a colorful regimental quarter guard of honor. The CG, while addressing the Corps Marshal and his management team at the agency's boardroom, extols him for a warm welcome and briefed him on the aim of his visit. Uh, the first is for us to consolidate. Uh, customs, we're not starting on ground zero. There are a number of uh, projects, innovation that we've started and we felt just felt we needed to build on this. Uh, the second is on uh, innovation. Uh, there are a number of innovative solutions that we can bring to uh, everyday problems. And the last but not the least is the collaboration. Uh, I believe that during this visit uh, we will be able to explore uh, each of these pillars uh, to deepen the collaboration uh, between us. And when we talk about working together, there are no better ways to do it than to see how we can assist each other in the discharge of our primary mandates. The road safety uh, has a mandate of uh, uh, secure road, reducing road accidents, and all of that public safety. The customs, we want to fight smuggling and ensure that vehicles whose, uh, on which customs duty are not paid do not get registered. And on these two major planks, uh, I think we could uh, find innovative solutions uh, for, for us to achieve this objective. He expressed commitment towards productive collaboration between the two agencies to achieve the common goal of enhancing national security and covering revenue laws through the use of technology. The Corps Marshal Doda Alibiu, while responding to the Comptroller General, applauded the CGC's passion for collaboration. I'm sure with that uh, database to assist the Customs and the FIC to track uh, vehicles that were brought in illegally, we get them. In fact, the essence is not even to get them registered. Yes, once we see those vehicles, they will not get registered and then probably we should put a process where either we report to the customs that yes, he, here we have a vehicle that does not have a valid uh, custom duty certificate so that you can take the next action on that vehicle. I think we should explore that. As I said earlier, our two organizations are working on to have a linkage between our database, what you have and what we have, so that uh, from your desk in your office you can view and see what and what and what you have or what we have, and we can also we can also relate and send you information uh, automatically. We, that means you can monitor online real time on all the activities happening at the motor vehicle licensing office, registration office, and then your office and the uh, Federal Road Safety Commission office. The leaders of the two agencies agreed that their coming together as one force will entrench ease of tracking vehicles without customs duty through establishing a seamless integration process. Muhammad Bashir, NCBN, Abuja.